Hey everybody, Sister Fantastic here with Sweet Pea, and today we are uh, presenting to you Self Care Saturday. So, I had something left over in my police stash that I wanted to try for you all before my giveaway ended, and this is the Blue Lotus Seed Mud Mask and Exfoliant. Gently resurfaces, detoxifies, brightens, tightens and smooths. It's a 10 minute facial. So I'm going to bid her adieu. She don't want to get down. <laughs> you want to say hi to everybody, don't you? See, I just don't like it. I have separation anxiety. This dog, y'all, is attached to me at the hip. Here, let's go this way. There we go comfortable that way okay so let's get started and uh, I have some things I'm going to show you while the mask dries I'm just taking a damp washcloth and I'm dampening my skin and we're going to get this right on my face I like their products y'all because they're sealed with a safety seal and we're practicing safety so this is just a little travel size sample of this mask and that's what it looks like. And it's just like the other one, the other mud mask that I used from Perlis. This has a bit of grit in it. And so we're just gonna By this pretty liberally today. Oh look, I'm already getting it in my hair. Okay, let's see if we can't spread this around. Stay away from the eyes, that tender skin there. I definitely want to get some right here on my upper lip where that those pimples have been healing, the skin's peeling off. I want to get that up. I need to use a body scrub today. Later on when I shower too, because this dry winter weather, y'all, I just feel like I'm one big giant flake. Okay, so not too thick of a layer, but thick enough. So, we're gonna let that dry. And this container right here holds uh, 0.5 ounces or 15 milliliters. So it's a half of an ounce. There's probably enough left in there for a couple more times. So, maybe three more, just depends on how heavy I use it. But it, it it's got like a white chalky kind of a look to it and it gets whiter as it dries. All right, so I'm gonna try to, let me put a headband on, just keep my hair out of it. I got flyaways and new growth coming in. Okay, now, what I have for you today, y'all, is my boxy pop-up, or boxy add-ons. several things that I ordered and I've already received a couple of the shipments and there's more coming so anyway I just wanted to share with you the items that I received so far which I'm really pleased to have them so let's see if I can't take this stuff out of the box without dropping the box so let's see here let's start Let's start with this, since we're talking about Perlise. I ordered the Blue, Lo Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Cleansing Milk. This is the full size of this. And let me show you what this looks like. It's 5.07 fluid ounces or 150 mils. And I like this cleansing milk so well that I picked this up in the add-on sale. sure 
how much I paid for that. Probably less than $12. $12 or less. I didn't put the prices of all this stuff down. I'll just have to go by my memory. Huh. And let's see, then I love uh, Touch and Soul products. So I picked up this Icy Sherbert uh, primer. It's a silicone free and a cooling effect. And so this is what that looks like. Which this is different from the other touch and salt primer that I have. This one um, has a, let me just show you what the product looks like. It has like a, instead of a white creamy texture, it has like this pink um, icy gel like substance. It almost looks like a crushed up slushy or something. And so anyway, they say it's silicone free, but it feels, when you put it on the skin, they say it feels like um, it's poor filling, like products, primers that have, you know, poor filling products in them. So that's going to be really super nice. And this is Korean, you know, Korean skincare. So I cannot wait to use this. All right, and then I did not get the Pharmacy Daily Greens oil-free gel moisturizer in my BoxyCharm base box. So I picked it up in the add-on sale because I did have the sample of this and I loved it. I thought it was amazing. And it's an oil-free gel moisturizer with moringa and papaya. And so let me just show you what that looks like if you haven't seen it. So I can open the box without tearing it all to pieces. I love this brand. They have a honey cleanser, it's a gel cleanser that I just absolutely adore. They have a balm, um, you know, they have balms that for cleansing as well. Here's what that looks like, y'all. Look at the jar. Isn't that pretty? And this gel moisturizer is, even though it's lightweight, when you put it on your skin, it just, it's so hydrating and it feels so rich and it's very effective. And then because of the papaya and the moringa in it, those are natural AHAs. Which, if you don't know what an AHA is, it's a, it's a, it's an acid that helps soften your skin and smooth it out. And so any unevenness that you might have, you know, from wrinkles, it just it helps with all of that. And uh, it's got this really nice scent to it really nice scent. So it says here on the side of the container, an oil-free, silicone-free daily moisturizer that delivers lightweight, lasting hydration without feeling greasy. This refreshing formula contains a blend of moringa water, papaya, and willow herb five to nutrients known to help reduce shine and clear pores of dirt and impurities. Powerful moisture magnets, hyaluronic and polyglutamic acids hydrate the skin, ideal for combination and oily skin. And for those of you that follow me, you know I have combination skin. So this is the kind of thing that helps with um, smoothing uh, out, you know, those places where you have where your pores show, smoothing out those places, and look at the back of my hand, y'all. Look how smooth that looks. Just with the one application. Oh, I love this stuff. It's amazing. So anyway, it's paraben-free, formaldehyde, uh, donor-free, synthetic fragrance-free, phthalate-free, mineral oil-free, cruelty-free. Fabulous! And you can use it twice a day. So you can use it morning and night. So this this right here, I mean, even though it's winter time and I'm dry skinned, 
you know, especially around the outside portion of my face, this is the kind of uh, moisturizer that I can use even at nighttime, like on top of other serums. So, anyway, mm, love, 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 love that product. So glad I got it. <coughs> and then everyone was ranting and raving on this Avant Hyaluronic Marigold. It's got this like five mile long name. But anyway, it's a micellar water with hyaluronic acid. And I just love the way it looked, the way it separated. And it's such an expensive product. And because of FOMO, fear of missing out, I had to get it. So it's valued at $90. And I think I picked this up for 12 bucks maybe. But anyway, I have other micellar waters particularly the Garnier uh, waterproof formula that I really really like but I wanted to try this since it has hyaluronic acid in it. So anyway another cruelty free product. Okay and let's see here. I picked up the Dr. Brandt DNA which means do not age triple peptide eye cream so I've never tried their eye cream but I love this brand and I trust this brand everything I've ever had from them has been fabulous so pick that up and then I got the Malin and Goetz recovery treatment oil Let's see what this looks like. The package, y'all. I haven't even opened this yet. But Birchbox did some enzyme masks and some creams and stuff. Look at the packaging on that, y'all. Isn't that a pretty bottle? Let's see what this oil looks like on top of this cream. Because this is like something I would do at night. I would you know, go in with some serums and then that moisturizer and then I might put a couple of drops of oil on top of that. Ooh! That. Yeah. Talking about hydration. This is awesome. Mm. It's a recovery treatment. So like, this would be great for like today. You know, when you use a mud mask. You know, and uh, you want to replenish the moisture in your skin. It says our fast absorbing treatment synthesizes a blend of nine antioxidant rich oils that nourish and hydrate to help address the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. So it says apply five to seven drops on clean skin. So this is one fluid ounce. It has a really nice smell too. Wow. So looking forward to trying that. Okay. <clears throat> then I got a couple of um, like they have those like sales that are like two for the price of one. So I took advantage of that. I got uh, two of the Mud Masky blue, blue light protection masks. And these are rather expensive, but I didn't have to pay a high price for them. And I got two for one. So to me, that was a steal. I couldn't pass that up. And if you've watched my most recent video with Juvia's Place, I share at the end of it a few products that I'm sharing with you all and uh, I can link that up here in the cards for you. Anyway, inside that box is um, one of these and also one of these, the Billion Dollar Brow Charcoal Beauty Sponge, Charcoal Infused Beauty Sponge, which I'm ready for a new beauty sponge myself because this one right here that I've had from Illuminate or Illuminati sure how to pronounce it anyway it's it's starting to like uh, I don't know if you can see that or not but it's see real close it's starting to peel up 
and little particles are peeling away and, and it sticks to your face and it's so it's time to get rid of that so I need to replace it so I thought maybe I would try that beauty sponge and then give the other one to you all and then also in that giveaway box is the I got these two for one as well and then the last two for one thing I got was this liquid corrector from Jekka Black because I have one already and I wanted a backup and this is the 2.0 which is like a peach color and you put that on underneath your concealer <laughs> and it helps to uh, correct those dark circles and those bags underneath your eyes and then when you go in with your concealer on top of this after it dries it's just a beautiful effect so I got two of those and I shared one of them with you all in that that video that I mentioned so again that's up in the cards you guys can get back to that and <clears throat> see what that's all about okay and then I got uh, three makeup items here uh, one of them is from Aesthetica. It's a sunset bronzer. Look at the packaging on that. It's like super shiny. And when I saw this on the website, I think it was only like $4. But I love bronzers and I'm always open to trying new shades. And so this one comes in a compact with a mirror. And there's the shade right there it's not too warm it's kind of on the cool side and I thought well if it doesn't work out for me for a um, bronzer I could always use it as a contour shade so we'll have to try that out soon in an upcoming video see what it looks like on my skin I tend to go for um, bronzers that are warmer than this because of my complexion with me. I'm almost like a ginger. I got like strawberry blonde hair, but it's gotten more, less strawberry and more um, gray as the years progress. But there are strands in there that's like a medium brown as well. So it's kind of, it's a unique hair color. And then some strands are blonde. And then, so anyway, it's just a unique combination of hair strands that I have. And, uh, but as I age, um, I look less gingerish like, uh, especially once I get a full coverage foundation on that covers up all the freckles and I add um, eyebrows. You know, when I draw my eyebrows on, I use a medium brown shade and that just changes um, my complexion somewhat. You know, when you first look at me, you're thinking, oh, she's got, you know, medium brown hair, medium brown eyebrows. You don't see the freckles. And of course the red in my hair is fading away so you know I'm, I'm looking less ginger but I am a ginger I mean all you have to do is just get close up and personal on some of my photographs and you can see I am covered I mean covered in freckles everywhere the Sun has been I've got freckles everywhere all right and then I got um, two more things here in this boxy add-ons. I got the Ultimate Lip Definer from Becca. And this is in the shade Playful. I don't know if y'all can see that or not. It's so little. Let me just show you what it looks like. So there it is. It's a really pretty red. And I thought this would be nice to use like for Valentine's Day those red lip lips and then on the other end there's a sharpener but there's also this cap that pulls off and there's like this rubbery tip like thing which is like a brush so I mean it's not really a brush it's it's like an applicator I guess it helps you know distribute the product so anyway it's like a three-in-one deal here really really nice so anyway I think I'm I'm not sure how much I paid for that probably about four dollars not much the skincare is more expensive it seems like than the makeup and then I um, did not get the all of you forever eyeshadow palette from Violet Voss I got the one from Ciate London so I picked this up. Be 
because I had to have it. Again, FOMO. So, nice palette with a mirror and there's all the shades. Look at those pretty greens. And this black that's up here in the corner, when you look at it really close, it's a really, it's all like a, um, a really dark, dark green. Like a greenish black. Let's just swatch it. I want to see what that color's like. I'm just going to put it on right over this skincare. So, boom. There you go. It's black. It's not a green. I thought it might be a like super dark green. But anyway, it shows up black. That's a really nice black too. So let's go in with a couple more of these shades. Let's go in with Charmed, which is that dark brown. There's that. Wow, look at that. Turn my pigment. Okay, and then Olive Glow. Look at that. Oh my gosh. And then Olive Me. Which is like more of a brownish olive. And then there's a, let me wipe my hands off here. And there's some other neutrals. Some other neutrals here, peach and white. And then there's like a uh, gold and like a silver. Let me, let me swatch these shimmers. To all of you. And Juicy. And Major Spotlight. And Love Burn. So there's there's six shimmers and there's six mattes in this palette. So let's just keep going here. Let's go. show up near as much as I thought it would so anyway it that's um, this is all of you this is juicy let's try major spotlight and love bird again I think I put them right on top of one another. Yeah, I think I made a mistake. <laughs> so there they are. That's the two of them mixed together. I made a mistake. So anyway, one's like a really pretty pearl and the other one's like a really pretty peach. Really light shades. They'd be great on the lid or in that inner corner. Okay, let's take this mask off, y'all. I'm gonna have to 
put some other skin care on. That dried really good. this up. I went all the way up to the hairline. Okay, that is pretty good. Pretty good. But anyway, there's the swatches. Love, love, love all these dark shades. And of course, I can always use a white. I mean, that's just something I gravitate towards is a white. So I'll have to come and do a makeup look with this. See what I can do. See what I can do. All right, y'all, well, the video is pretty long already, so I'm going to stop right here, and I'll just do some skincare off camera, but I wanted to share my haul with you guys, and I'll be back soon. I'll do um, I have one last Perlise product, one last Perlise product to share with you guys that I have not tried on camera from my collection, and that is this watermelon mask, so I'll do this for Mask Monday and share this with you guys then. And I'll do something quick for Monday. All right, well that's it for me today, you guys. I um, appreciate you watching. You have to let me know what you think about my haul. Wow, I'm excited about all this skincare. So anyway, and this palette too. I mean like, holy moly, will you look at that green right there? That's awesome. And I, I like having a black and a white in the palette, you know, because I can put shades on top of it. Okay, let me quit rambling. I love you all. Thank you all so much for watching. God bless you today is my prayer, and I'll see you in the next one.